One of the easiest upgrades you can perform on your portable or laptop computer is to upgrade the memory. Most of the manufacturers who make these systems realize that adding or upgrading memory is one of the things that a lot of people will do. So they've made this easy by putting access doors or removable panels on the, usually on the bottom of the system that makes this upgrade easy. So you don't have to disassemble the whole machine. In fact, in some cases, you don't even need any tools to do this type of upgrade. And if you do need tools, it's probably nothing more than a simple screwdriver. Let's take a look at an example of a typical uh, laptop uh, memory upgrade. Now I have here an IBM ThinkPad model. This happens to be a model 760E, uh, and the memory is uh, hidden behind a door on the bottom of the machine. So basically it's uh, to push this latch, slide this door over, and it merely pops off. So no tools are required to actually remove this. Then the memory cartridge itself is right underneath this door. You basically lift this up and turn it over. And what we have is a little memory card that has two 144-pin uh, SO DIMMs on it. Now, of course, prior to actually performing the upgrade, you need to purchase the uh, correct memory module. So what I have here is a 144-pin uh, SO DIMM. Now, this is EDO memory. That's the correct type of memory for this notebook. And this happens to be a 32 megabyte module that I'm going to install. Now, the little board, uh, we would call this a daughter board. This came with the notebook. This was uh, built into the notebook. And usually they'll have one module pre-installed. And then in this case, we have one extra socket where we can add additional memory. Now, micro or uh, SO DIMMs like this one install in a very easy fashion. I'm going to move the notebook over to the side here. So you can see how I install this into the, into the uh, little daughter board. Take the uh, small outline dim, line it up. You'll notice there's a notch in it, and the notch is off-centered. That's to prevent you from installing it backwards. It's only going to go in one way. So what I do is I set it up into the uh, module, and it goes at about a 45-degree angle like this. And you can see that I've got this uh, up on an angle here. And then you need to make sure that it's fully seated into the connector. Look at the uh, gold contacts along the edge. Make sure that it's pressed all the way in. Once it is, then you simply press down on it until these side latches engage and lock the module in place. Similarly, removing a module like this is very easy. All you do is move these little metal latches to the side, and the module will spring up, and then you can remove it at about a 45-degree angle. So upgrading this system can be done in seconds. I mean, it can be done in literally less than a minute. Merely pop the module in place, press it down, then I'm going to take the card, set it into the... Uh, into the system, add the little access cover, and slide it over, and the upgrade is now complete. So in most modern systems, you'll find upgrading memory to be this, this easy or straightforward. Now, some systems might have the module on a board that's non-removable. For example, this is a, another system which uses the 72-pin SO DIMM, and you can see that I just merely press these little latches to the side, and that would allow the module to pop up or to be installed. So uh, adding memory to a system like this is also very easy. Again, a little access panel covered the memory, usually on the bottom of the computer. If you're not sure where the memory is installed in your laptop, merely consult the manual, and it should give you the instructions for doing that. That's considered a user-performable upgrade. It's not something they consider you need to call a technician for. Anybody can do this. <clears throat> So using these uh, simple techniques, I hope you find that it's you know, very easy to upgrade the memory in your laptop or portable computer.